Bhosle. I'm a, your digital teacher and currently I'm working at Jilla Parishad Primary School A group and now in this virtual platform I'm working with you. Friends, today we are going to learn a topic, Unit 1. The name of the topic is Miss Slippery. This is the extract from the story of a lonely girl. Miss Slippery. This is the ironical name given to her by her classmates. A little girl, Sylvie, is teased by her classmates and all her friends due to her gender behavior, due to her some exceptional behavior. Manjas Mulano, Sylvie na machi ek vidhar tini aste, ani picha gharat kahi problems asta, ani tya problems mule ti jhama school madhe aste, ti ma picha kono. Repeatedly, varam 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 var test 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 soga ho dasta. Ani test soga halle mula tichya var gatli sagri mula tila ko phasa dasta. Ani tila ko phasa apna pane tila sahi cha evji miss slippery asa mand dasta. Ani hi asha ekaki padle na muli chhi ghost and the name of the topic is miss slippery. Let us watch the video. So students, today we are going to learn a very interesting story, Miss Slippery. This is an extract from the story of a lonely girl who is teased by classmates in school because she is upset and unnerved due to certain problems at home. She is unable to do any task well. The story tells us what happens next? So, children, let us listen the story of this lonely girl Sylvie by her own words. So, enjoy the story. I got ready and went to school. In the first period, our class teacher who taught us English told us to take out our composition notebooks. I took out the mathematics notebook by mistake. I replaced it quickly, but the teacher perhaps had kept her gaze fixed on me. She shouted, Come here with your book, Sally. I obeyed her. But her angry looks made my legs tremble and when I reached her chair, the notebook fell on her feet. <laughs> the teacher thought that I had dropped the notebook on purpose. Still, she stared at me with an all during look. Go and stand near your seat. She yelled. I kept standing, punished for the whole period. The next was history class and my favorite subject. The teacher had asked us to memorize the causes and effects of the Battle of Panipat. I was well prepared. She began testing all of us one by one. When my turn came, I went blank. The teacher gave me a stern stare while I stood there stiff, still with my head hanging down in shame. Mama and Papa continued their never-ending tips. Papa used every opportunity to express his annoyance. Mama, on her part, did not allow any such occasion to slip without turning it into a vociferous quarrel. The quarrel was between the two, but 
the punishment inevitably descended on a third one that is me at school whatever and whenever i heard raised voices i felt as if mamma and papa were quarreling sometimes even in the midst of silence mamma's scream came piercing through my ears and whenever i heard mamma's high pitched as my legs feared one day i was coming down the school stairs somebody from the top gave a frantic scream i fell and came tumbling down about 7 steps my elbows and knees were badly bruised my new frock was torn at the seams when i reached home mamma shouted i'm sick of you when will you stop making me pay through my nose for such extravagant losses mother seized me by the arm gave me a good jerk and seated me on the bed she fetched an antiseptic lotion and applied it to my elbow and knees but did not hug me within me lingered the yearning that she would hold me and console me even if she had given me just a sympathetic pat my smarting limbs would have been soothed my younger brother was close by me as mamma walked away to the kitchen he came and sat beside me he placed his little hand on my arm and he spoke are you in a great pain i hugged him tight and started crying again I used to walk quite cautiously yet I would often stumble One day the class monitress announced We will call her slippery Others sleep on wet ground Sally manages to sleep even on a dry land That provided the other girls of the class new scope for fun They teased me with the new title every day. Soon, a verse was composed in my honor. Slippery, slippery, sleeping without mop. Ask her the simplest question, no answer is your luck. I lived in perpetual fear of everyone. The girls, the teachers, the young and the old. When I was in class, I dared not move out and when I was outside, I was afraid of re-entering the class. Hey students, have you observed how Sally is teased by her classmates? Yes, you are right. By which name? Miss Slippery. And this is the title of our lesson. What is the title of our lesson? Miss Slippery. This is a nickname given by her classmate to a little girl, Sally. So, do you understand the lesson? Very good. Okay, let us learn the hard words. Gaze. Gaze means stare. Ek tak paane. Alluring look means a frightening look. Went blank. could not remember anything the kahin athone annoyance feeling of being angry ragalaine hosiferous noisy gundhal gadbad in inevitably certainly nischitpane ki keyword tremble tharthane frantic in extreme fear khub khub ghabran 
extravagant, very expensive means खुद महाग, yearning, longing for, ची इच्छा सुने, console, listen this is a very important word console मंजे सांद्वन करने, सूत्र become less painful, मक, M U C K मक, मक means चिखल, wet mud. Perpetual, constant. In this way, these are the hard words which came in our lesson. So, read the lesson once again. In the next part, we will see what happens with Siley. Thank you for watching this video. We will meet again.